All right, so the rooster is um, a very favorable, um, has a favorable energy, and mostly it is about intelligence. It's about a learning learning for this year. So you can make a huge difference in your life by finding something that, you know, either hone a skill that you already have or learn something new. I've talked about this um, in other animals as well. But here's another way that I think you can use this. Is there anyone else in this room besides me that goes to other um, personal growth, business conferences, does stuff online, has a bunch of manuals and um, recordings and booklet. Yeah, raise your hand, like be proud, be proud, right? Or you offer that kind of stuff, right? So this is a great year, if you have a rooster in your chart, to go back to all of those pieces of material that you probably paid a boatload of money for after you left the conference, you went home and you went, oh, got to take care of this life thing or that thing. And a year goes by, 10 years go by, and you have like a bookshelf or your computer hard drive and external hard drives are filled with this stuff. Have a look at it this year. You don't have a lot of other um, energies working with you this year, but if you just actually used that energy and got your return on investment finally <laughs> for what you paid for, wouldn't that be amazing? So use that for this year, okay? All right, um, it, now roosters, like think about a rooster. Um, who are my roosters in this room? Now, a lot of roosters typically um, are, are very attractive. Um, they usually wear a lot of bling or sparkle and that kind of thing, as you should because that's what a rooster should do, because, you know, when you see a rooster, it's like, hmm, look at me, right? So be careful with that, because you are going to be a target a little bit for robbery. So you, unfortunately, have that to watch out for, so be careful with that. And then the other thing you also need to watch out for is if you get any wind of somebody saying a false, watch your reputation, basically, is what I'm trying to say here. So if you have a rooster, you hear of someone talking an untruth about you, and it's almost better if you have somebody help you mitigate that problem. A colleague, a friend, it was like, do you know really the whole story on um, blah, 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 whatever that case may be. So a person can hear both sides of the story, because sometimes when people are like talking smack, it, it's usually like their problem, not yours, okay? All right, relationships, I think, again, it's going to be more about this self-improvement and, you know, learning how to be a better person. But, again, you know, get out and be visible. That doesn't mean that you can't um, be. And then as a metal um, animal, we all, this is another animal that does need to watch, about, just watch for distractions and things like that for, on the road or walking. Uh, just kind of pay attention to um, your surroundings and so you don't get in trouble about that. Wealth-wise, it might be a little bit tight year um, for you, so you just want to budget and watch your P&L. And then we, um, oops. That's a sensitive clicker. The rooster and the dragon are the best friends. And then for the snake ox, um, those are other animals that can use that month really, really well. But the animal that clashes with the rooster is going to be the rabbit. All right. Hello, I'm Lori Soleil and I was invited by Gail Knott. So I'm here to experience the Feng Shui event mostly because I really believe in the energies of the earth and how they affect our lives and the way that they guide us or block us. So I'm just here to hear about what's happening for the next year, heard great things about this event and I'm very excited to learn more.